Thank you so much, Buta. Well, with an ever-growing concern uh, at an alarming rate at which South Africans are affected by tuberculosis, we've been searching for remedies everywhere that we can. And it just so happens that there is a secret ingredient that could be helping us, and we've been adding it to our food for generations. Now, we all have questions around TB, and it's something that we know exists. But this morning, to talk about it, we've got Julia Crisillo to speak to us about it. Julia, I know that you're a chemist, you're an expert in the field, you're a life coach. Thank you so much for joining us on the show this morning to talk about this. We talk about leading causes in South Africa of TB, but what exactly are the symptoms and the risks of TB? How do I know I have it? Well, Ilana, the most important thing is a persistent cough that doesn't go away for, for after three weeks. So you're coughing all the time and it doesn't go away. Also, if you have a lot of night sweats, weight loss, poor appetite... Um, and also, um, yeah, I've said weight loss and uh, coughing up sputum mm. that is stained with blood. I'm told that we all have TB, but it's not active. What is that about? Yes, a lot of people get infected by TB and right. it lives inside the lungs. It gets covered up by the body. And then at various times in our lives, if we are immune compromised, if we have a chronic illness, the TB becomes active. Right. And then you have the actual symptoms. But a lot of the times it's just latent in our body. What are some of the other or the things that we can do. I mean, earlier when we spoke, Julia yeah. and I spoke at length about this because I was so curious. And I learned about turmeric. Now, turmeric is something that we put in our foods. I mean, I remember my mom making a good curry from her body, you know. Exactly. And that, that is, a, is, is this a secret ingredient that we've been looking for? Well, nature's pharmacy. You know, turmeric is one of those amazing spices because it has a very specific ingredient or a component of turmeric, which is called curcumin. And that is what actually gives turmeric its yellow colour. Right. Now, curcumin is the most studied phytochemical available. And it's incredible because they've discovered that with drug-resistant TB, which is a huge problem in this country, um, a lot of TB does not respond to conventional treatment. And they've discovered that curcumin is able to activate the immune system and kill off the drug-resistant TB. And so it has amazing implications mm. for people who suffer with TB. So we're talking to turmeric and then the active ingredients, yes. curcumin. Okay, yes. how, would I, how would I take it? Do you mix it and swallow? Is, it, is there a pill? Well, only 25% of turmeric is curcumin. Right. And you have to take a large amount of turmeric to get the effect. So what, the best way to take it is to take it in a capsule form, mm -hmm. um, a product called biocurcumin. Right. And um, the reason why I love this product is because it's very, very well absorbed and it has enough curcumin in to actually have an effect. It contains a, a, an ingredient called BCM95, which is the patented ingredient in curcumin. What, what else can curcumin heal or make better in the body? Yo, it is an amazing ingredient. The most important thing, it is anti-inflammatory. Right. And so many chronic diseases, the underlying cause is inflammation. Diabetes, arthritis, osteoarthritis, cancer, Alzheimer's, depression, um, because inflammation is the underlying cause. Mm. Sinusitis that can be used for. Any kind of condition where there's inflammation, cooking can be used. You said a key word this morning, inflammation. So yes. we're talking TB this morning. If you've just tuned in, we're talking about tuberculosis. Just quickly, which other things can we do to make sure that we improve our immune system and function? Let's go back to nature. Food. Uh, fatty, fatty acids from yeah. fish, oily fish, right. leafy green vegetables, oh, kale, nice. spinach. You're making me hungry. Garlic, <laughs> ginger, um, and then cut out as much as possible processed foods. Mm. Cause a lot of inflammation. Okay. Sugars, fizzy drinks, uh, fast food. So go back to natural, wholesome foods. That's the best thing. And to have lots of turmeric and take biocurcumin. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Julia, for joining us this morning. There you heard it. Go back to nature because that is where we find most of our healing. Turmeric, we are now going to that the body in us can be a good product. Thank you, Julia. Thank you very, very much. There's loads more happening on your feel-good breakfast show. Guys, over to you.